<laughs> what did I just witness? What's going on guys? So before we start today's video, I kind of want to talk about a package I received from Oxy. So if you don't know who Oxy is, he's one of my good friends. He makes War Thunder content, some exquisite content if I don't say so myself. You should check it out in the link in the description. But what he sent me is uh, he's a collector of aircraft memorabilia, kind of, not really memorabilia, but more so the, the paper stuff, picture frames and things like that. So uh, Oxy sent me a little package. He messaged me, what was it, like maybe two two months ago? Uh, I could be wrong. But he said, I'm going to send you some stuff. What's your address? Let me send you some, some pictures. And I said, of course. I love things to hang up in the background. And as you can see, one of them is in the background currently. But I'll grab it and show you a little bit closer. But the uh, first thing that he sent me is the June 2nd edition of the aeroplane, which is really cool. Like. I don't want to take this apart. You can see that the staples that are holding this magazine are actually rusted out because this is a really old magazine. Let me see if I can find a really cool picture, but this is just absolutely awesome. Uh, this old timey <laughs> ads that they got in this thing. It's, it's amazing. And I haven't gone through and actually read the whole thing yet. I kind of flipped through it just to see some of the, some of the stuff that's involved. But it's awesome, dude. They, they, you know, aeronautical engineer, airline maintenance and repair. Just like really cool ads and whatnot in this thing. It's a piece of history. And then uh, he sent me five picture frames. Really well uh, <laughs> shipped, too. So he, he sells this stuff in his store. So that's why I want you guys to go check him out if you're a fan of this stuff. But uh, without the glare really being in effect, I'm going to do my best to show you guys what he sent me. So the first thing... Let me take a look at this. It's the Yunkers Ju87 or 86K, which is a larger bomber made by Yunkers. It's in a nice frame. It's a nice diagram, as you can see. Really cool. And then we have a Hawker Hunter picture. Gorgeous Hawker Hunter picture. And he sent me some other stuff, but on top of that, this video is sponsored. So go check out Oxy, but on top of that, thank you to BenQ for sponsoring today's video. Go check the link in the description down below for this light bar. Now, this light bar BenQ sent me quite some time ago. Now, I, sorry BenQ, if <laughs> you should be watching today's video. Uh, I sent an email to you guys just saying that my video was done. I had a video in the past done with the sponsorship for this light bar. And, uh, I guess I never sent it to the right address because the email never got there. And then they bumped me today and I was like, oh, I guess you guys didn't get my email that I was uh, ready. So sorry, simple misunderstanding. But BenQ, a couple months back, sent me this light bar. I guess it just stands for more testing, right? Now, I've always been a fan of BenQ products. I used to use their monitors when I was playing Call of Duty at various events and lands and whatnot. Uh, but this light bar is amazing. Now, it is a... Uh, hang on monitor light bar this is a big weight right here that's adjustable uh, so it can fit any type of monitor size now it has a couple of different settings it has a dimness mode uh, so you can dim the light make it not as bright it has a warmth mode so you can make the light uh, less blue more blue etc and there's also some type of sensor so you can make it so whenever you sit down at your desk uh, it'll pop up it's uh, simply activated with this little it's a USB plug uh, similar to what you'd use on your Android device and these are touch buttons on top now this is full uh, I want to say aluminum I have no idea but it's metal the light bar itself uh, and it's done fantastic for me it's actually been great I've left it on for multiple days at a time uh, and for testing and it's it's been foolproof it still works to this day I use it as a secondary light or if I need to see my keyboard or whatnot at night and I absolutely love it so go check out BenQ link in the description down below and thank you BenQ for sponsoring today's video I, I just leave this on my secondary monitor right here uh, on the left hand side so on this monitor I have my track IR and my camera and on this monitor I have my light bar so go check them out thank you guys for sponsoring today's video let's get on with the BMP action two German vehicles in one day slick you must be off your rocker well, on the contrary I don't own a rocker I haven't played a BMP in a while that doesn't mean I can't do well with it though. For the record. Is that a I think I know what that is. I can't. Hold on. Hold on. 
That's no, that is a target. Okay, I can't. I can't do this. It's too tough. Oh my lord! Settle down now. Buy me dinner first. Is that oh come on why is there a Vickers why why is there a Vickers you know what the double the double up on the IS6 is good enough for me yo you know what's wavy is they took away the AP belt for the horde that's cool. I always like that. And they don't shoot straight. <laughs> I'm not complaining. I'm just saying this was a way cooler plane when you could just kill everything. I had way more style points. Two. You want to see some style points? I got something for you. I got something for you, my man. Papa, no, please. Why you do this? Hey, that's my friend. Only I can kill him. Okay. <laughs> Yo, he he did it. He outturned a horn. <laughs> oh boy, do I got something for you? Pure bliss. You're f shitting me. Why are you looking there? Why? Why are you behind me?
can, can somebody save me from this hell I live in? I know you saw this tactic in the Leopard 1 video. Yeah, we're doing the same one. This thing's kind of fast, though. I don't even have it spaded. So far, I'm actually a fan of the BMP-1. It's good. The round's good. It absolutely mops tanks. Pretty quick. Ha 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 Joke's on you, boy. Oh! <laughs> You've heard of ghost shells, but how about ghost missiles? Why? Why are you behind me? Yeah, we're fine. I think we've done it. We've gotten into a good position. I don't know <laughs> what that missile shot was, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Hey, that one killed in one shot from the front. Don't know how, but it did it. Big hits on him. Ooh. Got him. Nice. We're doing it. Oh, we're doing a chat. Not chat. Comment section. <laughs> oh, a little bit higher, a little bit higher. Oh my god, we're doing it.
Is that a dead? That's a dead tank? No! That's not legal. No, not a plane, not a plane, not a plane. It's okay. You know what? We got three kills. I get it. They want to take me out. Fair enough. Why are you going to be 108? I see the wyvern. That killed me. Come here, boy. He done. She gone. What? Well guys, I hope you enjoyed the video of me struggling using the German BMP. Come back shortly and I'll have it spaded and maybe we can have a better time. I don't think it'll make much of a difference, so. Uh, anyway, if you're new to the channel, click that subscribe button. At least if you want to see more War Thunder content. Regardless, it's been your boy Slick. I'll see you in the next one.